What's up, Trey Squad? Gang, 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 gang. Trey Squad. Trey, 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 Trey Squad. 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 Squad, 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 Squad. Welcome back to my channel. I miss you guys so much. If you're new, welcome. Join the family. Don't forget to subscribe. If you've been with me for a while, welcome. I have missed you guys very much. Um, I know, I know I've been gone for a while. Life has happened and I needed a, I always say that I joined, but this time it was for real. I needed the genuine break from the internet. I couldn't be on camera. Um, today was a very, today, I don't know why, but like I woke up and I'm like, I want to talk to my people. Like I miss you. So that's what this is um how are you guys doing how is everything going what are you doing during quarantine i hope you guys are staying at home and being safe and not going out because this virus is real all right it's very real so let's not play about and listen to the instructions being given to you um what have you guys been doing though <laughs> I don't even know what to say. It feels like I've been gone for a long time. Like, yeah. Oh, guys. <laughs> what is wrong with me? I'm acting like I haven't been on camera for, like, forever. But, like, literally, though, I haven't been on here. Um, a lot of life changes has occurred. And I just feel like I'm very grateful um, for so many people in my life and including you guys and I just wanted to come on here just to like talk it doesn't have much structure to what I'm saying I'm just talking and talking so hopefully I make sense towards the end of it um, but I have definitely missed y'all I feel like that's that's all I can keep saying because it's true and it just feels surreal that I'm actually on camera I didn't think I was gonna come on here but yeah going to sleep last night I kept thinking about you guys so I woke up today and I'm like okay I'm grateful so I'm gonna be on camera today um yeah <laughs> um what, what can I say um I've lost someone who is very important to me in my life and was part of my everyday routine and that person is my grandma so it really hit me hard and i couldn't be on here um i was already in quarantine <laughs> before all of this happened before all basically before corona happened i was already in quarantine i didn't want to see anybody i didn't want to talk i didn't want to chill i didn't want to definitely not be on camera um yeah and then when this happened corona happened i'm like they was like, everybody's going into quarantine. I'm like, what? Welcome to my life. Welcome to quarantine, guys. I've been here, so welcome. <laughs> and it was so surreal. But of course, this whole corona thing is very, very serious. And so many people are dying. And I'm like, wow, Lord, protect us all because we need you more than ever. And um, yeah, I, I was like, guys, stay safe, stay safe. Um, but yeah, quarantine, I feel like, with everything that is happening now, I genuinely think it's going to make people realize the things that are important in life, which is family, friends, um, being healthy, having food. Even toilet paper seems very important to people. And I'm like, guys, you know there are other alternatives. But anyway, but even those little, little things, I feel like, yeah, the things that go unrecognized a lot and things that we subconsciously don't take for granted every day i feel like the value of them are definitely showing and people are freaking out not being able to see their friends for a long time i'm like yeah see friends are very important but i feel like this is also a great opportunity for a lot of people to get right with god and get right with their friends and speak to the people that have hurt you and just sort things out because life is so precious and this moment definitely presents an opportunity for so many people to get a right, whatever right may be. Um, so yeah, and to not hold on to grudges, which is very, of course, easier said than done. But yeah, you just gotta let some things go, you know. Um, 
I feel like every day I just sit and uh, what's the word analyze the people in my life not necessarily intensely but mostly like for me I was mostly doing that with my grandma and kind of realizing the impact she's had on me and even sometimes when I'm speaking about her like I just I'm like wow this woman was everything kind of thing and she she's honestly helped me and instilled so many values in me that I'm just so grateful to have somebody like to have had somebody like her in my life and um, yeah, she is going to continue to live on in my heart and it's been very difficult to kind of let her go um, yeah I have my days moments where I'm okay and moments where I'm not but one thing that I know for sure was that I wasn't going to come on here to cry because I don't think I can ever come on camera and cry I find it so cringe and I think it's so, I don't know, I don't know the word for it, but I genuinely personally couldn't do it. So I wanted to get right off camera. And then when I was a little bit okay and a little bit mentally all right, I could have come back to you guys, which I am doing now. Um, I hope I don't take a very long break as I did in the past, but I continue to speak to you guys even when things are not going all right. But it's very hard to be vulnerable. Um, already for me in real life and therefore to be vulnerable on camera I think that it's a whole it's a whole new world that I don't think I don't know if I can get used to that um, but yeah because vulnerability is one of those things you know you can't just you can't just get vulnerable with everybody and it's something I struggle with and I try to I try to be vulnerable when necessary but even sometimes I stop myself even with my friends I'm like if I'm about to come, okay, guys, I gotta go and then hang up the phone because it's just so hard. But the few people that I've managed to be vulnerable with, I feel so grateful for that because I feel like I can just let it all out, you know? Yeah, so I explained to you some of the things going on in my life and losing a loved one. I never realized how painful, I mean, of course, losing somebody is painful, but I never realized how painful it is. Especially when the person is so dear to your heart and so precious to you um, And I feel like with this I definitely felt that impact and It was crazy. It's like your heart stops For in that in that few moment when you you get the news that this and this has happened your heart literally stops and I'm like wow like it's crazy um yeah so i've been adjusting to that i've been adjusting to my new reality and some stuff like that because um i'm one of the people that spoke to i spoke to my grandma every day so yeah it's it's, it's different not having to speak to her but um i still test her but i think eventually i will stop but right now i occasionally test her phone um just as a way of you know i'm still i'm still trying to deal with it but i think that helps a little bit but eventually hopefully i'll i'll stop um yeah what has been happening in you guys' lives and what have you how do you deal with losing people or pain or changes how do you deal with changes in your lives um yeah what else corona <laughs> let's talk about corona has it as i said before it's gonna make people appreciate life for sure um we live in history right now and it's crazy because the whole world is affected by this covid19 and it's it's crazy like this is the stuff that you will read you will read a book about um something that occurred in the past and it's like we are living in it now and it's it's, it's crazy to me um but what have you guys been doing i've been chilling i've been on house party <laughs> we need to talk about house party oh my that app scares the crap out of me the first time i got it here i was so shocked literally i downloaded the app 
and then I put my details in and then I went I, I acted one there um, and as soon as I did that somebody was on the line connecting I'm like what like literally if I was dressed inappropriately or I don't know I don't know if something anybody could have caught me off guard and at that time when I downloaded it I didn't know that was how the app was so I was so shocked I was like oh, what is this <laughs> but my sister kept laughing at me because she was like house party has been here for so long so why are you guys all moving as if this is all new and I'm like listen quarantine and coronavirus has got people discovering things that we didn't know existed before okay allow us allow us um <laughs> but that's always been happening i've been going on house party here and there no but house party has been great it's been a great way to talk to people for sure i feel like i should have a whole video just on house party because it's crazy it's actually crazy and i but i love it though because I, it gave me the opportunity to see all my friends just talking and chilling and jamming to some music but yeah, it's been, it's been great. Um, are you guys on house party? If you are, should we add each other? Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. But um, if you guys are on house party, definitely enjoy it because I, that app is funny. It's fun. Um, I'm thinking if I should join. I downloaded TikTok, guys, a long time ago, but I never ever used it. Um, at the time, I had exams and I had coursework and stuff like that. So... Of course, I wasn't going to spend my time, but now I have a bit of extra, extra time. Um, so maybe I will jump on TikTok. Should I? I don't know. But yeah, I just wanted to kind of catch up with you guys and let you guys know what's going on and talk to you guys and just check in. It's been a while, um, but I'm so grateful for you guys and the fact that I get to come on here and update you guys and tell you guys comfortably what is going on it's a blessing um i hope you guys are taking very very good care of yourselves and you are not going out so much you're drinking a lot of water and you're just chilling at home and utilizing this you know this time of our lives and just watching youtube videos watching catch up on all the videos of mine that you haven't watched and if you're new welcome to the family um Thank you, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Trey Squad, I love you. Mwah. <laughs> bye bye. Trey, Trey Squad. Trey Squad. Trey, 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 Trey Squad. <laughs> wow, is this you, yeah? Is this you? Is this you, 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 you? <laughs> I miss you guys so much. Welcome. I miss you. I miss you. I miss you. Okay, I'm gonna go now. I will see you guys soon. I will see you guys soon. Subscribe. Subscribe.